Chick-fil-A has cracked the code of having a successful fast food chain compared to its competitors. They've not had a terrible financial year in recent times, which means they must be doing quite a lot of things right. There are so many reasons behind this success, but let's begin with the owner, which is a huge part. Truett Cathy, the founder of Chick-fil-A, was indeed a skilled businessman, and his success was attributed to both business acumen and strong religious principles. Driven by his faith, he actively incorporated charitable efforts and ethical principles into his business practices. Kathy, who taught Sunday school for over 50 years, was involved in establishing scholarships and finding homes for foster children. One distinctive aspect of Chick-fil-A is that it has remained a private company throughout its existence. Truett Cathy believed that public investors might not approve of the extent of the company's charitable activities. Before his passing in 2014, he made a contract with his children, allowing them to sell the business but prohibiting them from taking it public. To date, his children have honored this agreement, maintaining Chick-fil-A's status as a privately held company. Truett Cathy's entrepreneurial spirit dates back to his childhood, during the Great Depression, when, at the age of eight, he started small businesses to contribute to his family's income. Hailing from Atlanta, the headquarters of Coca-Cola, he would purchase six packs for a quarter and then work to sell the bottles for a nickel each. While initially making less than a penny per sale, this initiative grew and evolved into various other small ventures. However, these endeavors were temporarily halted when Truett and his brother Ben served in the army during World War II. They resumed their entrepreneurial pursuits upon their return. In 1946, Truett and Ben Cathy ventured into the restaurant industry. Pooling together their savings, which amounted to $4,000, they also secured an additional $6,000 through a bank loan. With this capital, they opened a modest diner just outside of Atlanta, strategically located near a Ford plant. The aim was to attract repeat business from the plant workers. True to its humble beginnings, the establishment was remarkably small, featuring only four tables with chairs and ten stools along the counter. In line with its compact size, it was initially named the Dwarf Grill, a moniker that was later changed to the Dwarf House. The Dwarf House operated around the clock, being open 24 hours a day. The Cathy brothers' hands-on leadership style translated into a demanding schedule with one brother working for 12 hours and then being relieved by the other, maintaining a continuous operation. This relentless work ethic contributed to the success of Chick-fil-A. Notably, Chick-fil-A has consistently adhered to the practice of closing on Sundays. This decision, rooted in religious beliefs, becomes even more impressive considering that they have surpassed Subway not only with fewer locations, but also by operating for fewer days. Truett Cathy explained that the policy began during the early days of the Dwarf House, providing everyone, including himself, a much-needed break from the demanding and continuous schedule. After only three years of running the Dwarf House business together, tragedy struck when Ben Cathy, along with a third Cathy brother named Horace, died in a plane crash. Following Ben's passing, his portion of the Dwarf House was transferred to his wife, and a year later, Truett Cathy bought it from her. This unfortunate event resulted in Truett taking sole ownership and running the business alone. Expanding his vision, Truett opened a second location, but it faced challenges and eventually burned down in a fire in 1960. Surprisingly, this setback turned out to be a catalyst for positive change, ultimately leading to the creation of Chick-fil-A. We're going to be looking at a few reasons why they're successful, and the strongest reason is marketing. Chick-fil-A, unlike some global fast food chains, didn't have a substantial advertising budget. In 1995, the iconic Eat More Chicken slogan made its debut on a modest billboard in Atlanta, Georgia. Conceived by the Richards Group, this clever advertising campaign featured cows advocating for chicken consumption over beef. Despite the limited financial resources, the billboard campaign proved immensely successful, garnering significant publicity for Chick-fil-A. As Chick-fil-A expanded, the rebellious cows continued their unconventional foray into fast food marketing. The campaign evolved to include unconventional placements, such as buildings, water towers, and banners trailing behind airplanes, demonstrating the brand's creativity and effectiveness in gaining attention with a modest investment. 
The chicken-loving cows with their pro-chicken message haven't limited their presence to billboards alone. They've made appearances on radio, television, and at sporting events, ensuring their message reaches a broad audience. Their influence has even given rise to a special day at Chick-fil-A called Cow Appreciation Day, celebrated on July 14th. On this day, dedicated Chick-fil-A enthusiasts show up at their local restaurants dressed as the iconic rebel cows. Also, Chick-fil-A stands out in the fast food industry for its exceptional worker retention and satisfaction rates. Approximately two-thirds of Chick-fil-A employees who start working for the chain as teenagers continue to be a part of the company as they transition into adulthood. This contrasts with the high turnover often seen in the industry, where young employees may move on for various reasons. The family-owned chain adopts a conscientious approach to hiring employees for its stores, selecting individuals who align with the company's values and culture. This meticulous hiring process extends to the selection of franchise operators, emphasizing a commitment to maintaining a positive and cohesive work environment throughout the Chick-fil-A network. Becoming a Chick-fil-A franchise operator comes with a unique commitment. They are not permitted to run other businesses. This rule ensures that operators can fully focus on managing their Chick-fil-A location, dedicating their time and attention to the restaurant. The requirement to exclusively operate a Chick-fil-A location is in place to avoid distractions that could impact the success of the business. Chick-fil-A's success is evident when competitors feel compelled to emulate their offerings. The popularity of Chick-fil-A's fried chicken sandwich prompted established chains like McDonald's and Popeye's to respond swiftly. Both companies introduced their versions of the classic chicken sandwich, emphasizing the widespread appeal of this simple yet delicious item. While a fried chicken sandwich with pickles might seem straightforward, it's the careful choice of ingredients and execution that make Chick-fil-A's version stand out. McDonald's, which has long had the McChicken, recently introduced three variations of a crispy chicken sandwich, all featuring pickle chips, a clear response to the demand and success of Chick-fil-A's iconic sandwich. Another reason is its renowned fried chicken sandwich, a customer favorite since its inception in the 1960s. While the fast food chain offers various popular menu items, including chicken tenders, it's the iconic sandwich that draws people to wait in line. The sandwich stands out for its simplicity, eschewing complicated or fancy elements and relying on fresh, straightforward ingredients to consistently deliver a delicious product to customers. This commitment to simplicity and quality has contributed significantly to the popularity of Chick-fil-A's signature sandwich. Chick-fil-A's famed chicken sandwich begins with a boneless chicken breast, seasoned and breaded, then pressure cooked in 100% peanut oil. The golden brown chicken breast finds its place on a toasted and buttered bun, topped with crisp dill pickle chips. The magic lies in this simplicity, creating a delicious combination that sets Chick-fil-A apart. While other fast food chains including McDonald's offer fried chicken sandwiches with pickles, Chick-fil-A's version is widely regarded as the industry standard. The people who have experienced the distinct taste of this chicken sandwich understand why it has become one of the key factors contributing to Chick-fil-A's continued success. The culture at this restaurant is also second to none. While creating appealing food is essential for any fast food restaurant, factors beyond the menu can significantly impact a chain's popularity and customer loyalty. Chick-fil-A has distinguished itself by prioritizing a positive customer experience. One notable detail contributing to this experience is the company's training for employees to respond with my pleasure when interacting with customers. While seemingly a small detail, in the highly competitive fast food industry, these nuances can make a substantial difference in shaping a customer's perception. Chick-fil-A stands out as the most statistically polite chain in the restaurant business, with its employees generally reporting higher job satisfaction compared to many other fast food establishments. This job satisfaction is palpable and contributes to a superior customer experience. Satisfied customers are more likely to return and spend more money. While many companies aim to create positive experiences for customers, Chick-fil-A appears to excel in this aspect. Importantly, the high quality of both the food and the service contributes to Chick-fil-A's success in providing an overall exceptional customer experience. In 2019, Chick-fil-A showed good financial performance, generating nearly $10.5 billion in sales. This remarkable achievement positioned Chick-fil-A as the third highest earner in the fast food industry, 
following the global giants McDonald's and Starbucks, both of which have a vast international presence with thousands of stores worldwide. Despite having fewer stores compared to many other fast food chains, Chick-fil-A does not face a disadvantage in earnings. On the contrary, the fast food chain takes pride in the fact that its stores outperform those of most other chains. Chick-fil-A's stores consistently achieve higher revenue per location, showcasing the effectiveness of its business model and customer appeal. Chick-fil-A has indeed managed to turn what might be perceived as a weakness into a strength, with its individual stores outperforming competitors despite having fewer locations. However, the company isn't resting on its laurels and has plans for further expansion to compete more aggressively. While expansion has proven challenging, especially in international markets, Chick-fil-A remains a formidable force. Despite the setbacks in certain expansion plans, Chick-fil-A stands out as the only chain that has consistently reported an increase in sales every year of its operation. This sustained growth is a remarkable achievement for any business and solidifies Chick-fil-A's position as a lasting and influential player in the fast food industry. We have come to the end of today's video. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel for more content.